Hi, I'm Bruce Mackey from Mackey Insurance. Mackey Insurance has been a proud member of the Bay of Quinney community for the past 45 years, delivering quality and effective insurance products. We've also been a proud sponsor of the Balbo Senators since their inaugural season in 2017. We are proud to sponsor the development of professional hockey in our region. I'm Bruce Mackey, and this is Road to the AHL. Up to Thompson again. Taking a peek through, Quenville, Greg, Quenville, Thompson, fired on, scores! Lassie Thompson from the point! Thompson comes back and fires and scores! Lassie Thompson has his third of the season and the Senators tie the game. Played across, Thompson shoots, he scores! Lassie Thompson is red hot. He's got his third goal in two games. It's another power play marker to open the scoring. Uh, I'm Lassie Thompson. I'm from Thunberg, Finland. I probably started playing hockey when I was seven because all my buddies from school play hockey and I was like, okay, I want to do something. And I think that was a, easy to jump, jump in because all, all the friends play hockey and then just went to rink every day and it was a lot of fun all with my friends and my dad was like really into hockey. So I think that was a big part of, part of my hockey when I started. I didn't have to be by myself and obviously I make a lot of friends and a lot of those guys still be my friends from the, my junior years. So that's pretty cool, I think. In my junior years, we had a couple players whose whose dad was coaching us, and the other other coach was used to play in hockey in Finnish league too. I think he was a big part of my my hockey career, why I started and why I became like a pro hockey player. He he was a D coach and. He was a big part for me and I've been around a lot of old players so I think that's a big part for me and how I learned my game. When I, when I actually realized like I, I might play hockey for pro, uh, under, I was in under 16 team uh, in my hometown playing juniors and I wasn't a great skater or anything so me and my dad talk about a little bit. We try to find some guy who who can actually like maybe a little bit help me to get better skater. And we found one guy whose son was playing playing in the league. So he we got a couple times on the ice and he videoed my skating and all that stuff. And then I I don't know what what actually happened, <laughs> but then I realized like okay, skating was coming my strength and then I start using it I get better I get a lot of like of course I was grown getting like a little bit bigger and then I make it under 18 team as a young guy and that was a big part for me and then play those games with a little bit older guys I think that was a point when I realized like okay I, I can I can play hockey actually and not do anything else Foot on right wing, back to topping, back to foot, foot, blue line, tubes in his shot, the score! Lassie Thompson may be the man that gets credit with the goal, and it's a long time coming for Lassie. The move lost it, Farron got it, blue line, through it, Kata shot, blocked by Kendall for three by Thompson, score! La, la, la. Hit a body in front. Thompson will tickle the twine for the second time. It's trailed by a single. Blue line for Lassie Thompson. A four on three power play. Lassie, the shot. Score! Lassie Thompson, a laser beam from the blue line. It's a power play goal. And the Rockets have tied it. My under 20 year back home, I was 17. I played an under 20 team, and then I I made my first contract with the pro team. 
but we had a lot of talks and I didn't want to play like second highest league in Finland and I didn't want to play juniors anymore back home because obviously it wasn't that that good than overseas so I had a lot of buddies who played here in DOP and in the OHL and I talked to those guys like how you guys feel like how is that league and everything like that and of course my age and like how is that like it's gonna help me and then it was a it was a hard to choice to for me. I need to leave home first time ever. I'm 17, like going overseas by myself. But uh, I get great team. Kelowna drafted me, and they as soon as they drafted me, they contact me and figure out like if I want to come. And I, I was like, I was pretty happy. Like, okay, I want to see. I want to see these cards. Was what's it like to be here and play kind of like pro hockey, but still juniors. So they got me everything like build family. We conduct my build family. They was great. They they really take care of me. So I think they help a lot. Obviously, it was it was pretty hard to move out home, not gonna be around my family, my parents. Still, still kind of young kid. Of course, first point when I get there, it was hard. Like try to figure out everything and try to try to learn English so I can make, I, I, I can talk to coaches, my teammates. But I mean, of course, hockey was foot was totally different there. Like guys was actually playing hard, and it, it wasn't like the juniors back home anymore. Like it was a. It was a real hockey, and there wasn't any more boys. Like it was men's hockey. What I feel on my first point when I get there, but I think I handled that pretty well, and it was actually cool. And honestly, I missed that time. First point, it was it was hard. I didn't I didn't speak a lot of English, and that was like the uh, hardest part of it because I, I wasn't kind of able to talk a lot of guys and I was kind of by myself, but now when you think about it later, it was, it was pretty cool year and I'm pretty happy I make that choice. Back to Nolan Foot, waits and holds, now for Lassie Thompson, left dot, SCORE! Lassie Thompson in overtime! Shot, whipped it wide, remains far side board, collected here by Topping. Blue line for Lassie Thompson, he'll fire, SCORE! Lassie Thompson, dying at long distance! Here's Thompson, skeets in, SCORE! It was 2019 when I get drafted. I was I was pretty excited for that, and I got my family there too. And uh, honestly, I wasn't sure like what's gonna happen uh, if I'm going second round, third round, fourth round, even get drafted. Like I wasn't I I didn't have like good idea what's gonna happen. It was a great moment when you call your when they call your name at the first round and you go you walk to the stands, but. I mean, I can't remember a lot about that that day. It was just a crazy day, and like every everything after the, you get drafted, all the media and that kind of stuff. But now, when you think about it, it's a sick moment, and and now I've been here last three years, and I I have seen a lot during those three years. So I think I'm pretty proud of that. They win the draw, Thompson. Lucini Thompson shoots and scores! A Lassie laser beam, a Tom Bomb has made it 3 0 on another power play goal. Tries to send it back to the point, gets there. Aspro, Thompson fires, scores! A Lassie laser beam with 13 seconds left. The Senators are back in front, and Lassie Thompson extends the point streak in style.
Lassie Thompson driving in. He'll score on a backhand. And Lassie Thompson gets a friendly bounce. He drives to the net and he opens the scoring for the Senators. My future goals, obviously, yeah, I want to play in the NHL full time. You know, I want to be part of the Ottawa organization. For me, it's it's just uh, try to improve my game every day to make there and stay there. Obviously, I get a couple chances last year, a couple chances this year, and it's a, it's an incredible moment for me as a young kid to make the NHL debut and play a couple games in the NHL. So um, I don't think about that too much right now. I just, I want to get better and make there again and want to stay there. But you need to enjoy those moments where you already had there. Because you never know when, it, when it's going to be the last time. And our staff here is doing literally everything for us to us make an NHL and I think that's a big part of uh, growing hot as a hockey player to make those little steps to make in the NHL and stay there. For me, it's a big part make make an improvement here, and you can play in the same level every night here, and then make the same thing in the NHL, play in the same level every day. And I mean, we are we are humans. Like it's not going to be perfect all the time, so try to learn learn from the low moments and then think about the, those high moments I would say that like if you feel you want to do it like me, when I when I was 17, and I was thinking maybe come overseas and play juniors here, or maybe stay home, step out a little bit from from the comfortable zone, and make that call. Like those are like great moments when you actually get get yourself through something what's what's not that comfortable, and I think that's the biggest part. Like have fun and enjoy the moment.